Hey everyone and welcome to the club and welcome to our weekend draw and color series. Today I'll be showing you how to draw and color a Valentine's rose. The first thing we're going to do is start in the very center of our page with a point. From here we're going to draw on the top edge of the left petal. So let's start in the center. We're going to curve up and over towards the left. Now from here we're just going to blend to a curve going up. From the top, we're going to curve down and in, and then up towards the center. So let's start on the left side, curve around, and then bring this down towards the bottom. And I'm just going to pull that up towards the middle. Now we're going to take that and flip it over, but we're going to tuck this in behind the left pedal. So we step up, we're going to draw on that same top curve, going up and then out towards the right. Now we're going to blend into a curve going up towards the tip of the pedal. Now let's curve down and in towards the center. Bring this down, round out the bottom, and then pull that up right in the middle. Now we're going to draw in the center of the rose. We're going to start on the left side, just on the top of the petal here. Start by curving around. We're going to draw a swirl, going over towards the right. Now we're just going to bring that back in. Now I just want to swirl this back around, going out, and then back in towards the center. From that center line, I'm going to draw a straight line coming down. Now let's move to the outside. From the left side here, I'm gonna curve down and then just pull that in. Let's go to the right side and curve in the opposite direction, coming down and then in. Now let's go to the very top. We're gonna to leave a small gap in the center. On the left, I'm gonna curve up and out towards the left side. Go to the right and curve in the opposite direction. Now we're just gonna pull this down in behind the side petals. Let's start on the left, curving out. I wanna leave a little overlap on the ends. Do the same thing on the right. Now we're going to move to the outside and curl over the side petals. So we're going to step up on the left, we're going to curve up and then down on the left side. Let's line this up on the right and do the same thing. Now from the left side we're going to curl in and then down towards the bottom of the rose. Start by curving in. We're just going to follow the curve of the rose coming all the way down and we'll just pull that in. Let's do the same thing on the right. Curving up and down, go around the side petal and then we're just gonna pull that in towards the bottom. Now we're gonna connect the bottoms of the petal with almost like a half circle. We're gonna start on the left, curve down and then back up on the right. Let's add two leaves curling down the side. Starting from the bottom right in the center, to curve down and out towards the left. Now we just want to curl down the end of the leaf. Go across and then down. We're going to take that and flip it over on the right. Starting from the center, curve down and out towards the right, and then we'll hook down the edge of the leaf. Let's go back to the left side. I'm going to curve this up and in behind the rose. And we'll do the same thing on the right. I'm going to add the center seam of the leaf. Starting from the tip, we're just going to curve over and in. Now let's draw the stem along the bottom. Now we're going to curve this over towards the left. Starting from the inside of the right leaf, we curve out towards the left, and then we'll bring that over towards the right. Let's draw the outside. We're going to step over, just follow that same curve, going all the way around, then down towards the bottom. Let's close off the bottom with a curve going around. Now we're gonna add two more leaves along the side. Starting on the left, right out here, we're gonna curve up and then out towards the left. Let's draw on the bottom of the leaf. Starting from the tip, we're gonna start by curving in and then down. And we're gonna round this out and pull that up just on the outside of the stem. Curving down and then just pull that up. Let's draw on the top of the leaf. Start from this point, we're just gonna curve up and then down towards the inside of the bottom leaf. Now we're gonna take that leaf and flip it over, but we're gonna bring it down towards the bottom. Starting on the right, we're gonna curve up and then out. Let's draw on the bottom of the leaf. We're gonna curve in and then down. Now we're gonna round this out and pull that back in. Again, leaving a little gap along the side of the stem. Let's go back to the top. Curve up and 
and down. Let's add a few thorns along the side of the stem. Starting on the left, draw a sideways V, going out and then back in. On the right side, we're gonna go in the opposite direction, going out towards the right and then back in. Let's add one more along the bottom, coming down and then back in. Now let's go in with a red marker and color the top of the rose in red. Let's start on the outside. And now we'll go in and color the leaves and the stem in green. And that's pretty much it. There we have it. There's our Valentine's Rose. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. Make sure you subscribe and send me your requests in the comments below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again soon.